for many people, exercising on the chinning bar is a common thing. The chinning bar is considered a very useful exercise equipment for men, women, and children. Exercises on the bar are included in the school physical education program. In this video, we will talk about what changes will occur in the body if you exercise on the bar. So watching until the end of the video will be very interesting to the channel. Please subscribe. Your support is very motivating. The chinning bar is a valuable piece of exercise equipment for the health of your back and spine. It serves as great equipment to improve posture, strengthen the muscular corset, and the whole body's health. What are the benefits of pulling up on the chinning bar? First, physical activity on the bar replaces drugs and acts prevention of immune system weakness and as a consequence, prevents many diseases due to a sedentary lifestyle. Care should be taken that the body does not stagnate and thus does not provoke hyperdynamic. It is even possible to keep the body healthy even with irregular, non-strenuous workouts. So it is possible to do gymnastics or even just hang on the bar. But the effect will be much stronger if you exercise regularly and according to a schedule is much more effective. At the same time, follow the basic rules of the exercises on the horizontal bar. It is better to hang out for 1 or 2 minutes every day than 10 minutes once a week. Second, hanging on the horizontal bar allows you to remove tension from the spine, which is accumulated throughout the day. The spine is stretched and the back muscles are stretched, thereby relaxing them. Stretching is recommended for locomotor system problems or minor dystrophic changes in the intervertebral discs. When cartilage tissue has eroded the distance between the vertebrae is reduced and the curvature of the spine is altered. Third, when pulling up on the bar is a huge strain on the cardiovascular and respiratory systems. Therefore it is necessary to perform exercises correctly, so as not to harm your body, and vice versa healthier it. To begin with, exercises on the chinning bar should be done without weights to avoid injury and create a good basis for future physical development. Only with time is it possible to take additional weights and weights to help. Classes on the chinning bar lead to slimness strengthening the muscles of the back and arms, A, B, S, and chest. And if you do it with weights, it will help increase the muscle and strength capacity of the body. Training on the chinning bar is better to do after warming up your body with a warm hot shower, regular push-ups, or cardio jogging. For men, exercises on the bar are of particular importance. For men who want to normalize and improve potency, increase erections, and normalize urination. If you do strength exercises on the back and legs, then testosterone is produced. The muscles of the crotch are strengthened, improves improves blood circulation in the organs, normalizes the level of male hormones and adrenaline, which improves mood and reduces muscle tension. Also, exercises on the bar for men will be beneficial because they entail maintaining physical fitness, and oxygenation of the brain, heart, and other organs, strengthening the spine and muscle corset, increasing stamina and body strength, and increasing the volume of the shoulder girdle, arms, and back. For women, the chinning bar is very useful for women's bodies. It relieves stress, forms a beautiful and correct posture, pumps ABS, legs, and buttocks, allows you to lose weight, increases the volume of the chest, strengthens ligaments and joints of the hands, and strengthens the spine. For children, today's children are very fond of playing while sitting at computers and gadgets. Watching TV, this leads to problems with posture, and gradually appearing scoliosis or osteochondrosis. To avoid this, 
you need to teach your child to do various exercises, including hanging on the bar. This way the back will be healthy and taut and smooth. Exercise on the horizontal bar allows you to strengthen the back, arms, and ABS. In general, the benefits of the chinning bar for men, women, and children are the same. What matters is how difficult and which exercises men prefer, which women, and which children. Contraindications to exercises on the bar. There are almost no contraindications to bar exercises. There are no restrictions on criteria of age, height, and weight are not provided. It is best to be engaged under the supervision of the trainer, especially if you have any back disease. An experienced trainer will tell you what you can do on the chinning bar and what not, but if you do it yourself, Training on the chinning bar is contraindicated if you have osteochondrosis, intervertebral hernia, kyphosis, lordosis, scoliosis, spondylosis, protrusion of intervertebral discs, joint diseases of the upper extremities. Correct technique of pulling up, in order not to harm the body and get the benefit of pulling up on the chinning bar, it is necessary to choose a bar of sufficient height so that you can reach it pulling up on your toes. First prepare, that is warm up the body. Never jump on the crossbar, it gives an additional load to the body from the very beginning of the workout, and never jump off it. When pulling up, exhale, when lowering, inhale. You cannot make jerks, or sudden movements. You must perform everything smoothly. The technique of pulling up is as follows. While hanging bends your knees and pull them back without pushing them under you. After a deep breath bring your shoulder blades together, pull up slowly, relax your muscles, try to keep your head straight and look straight ahead. Breathe out till the upper point. Then slowly lower yourself without pausing and inhale. Repeat the exercise as long as you can. Injury Prevention do not forget about the safety precautions. Perform pull-up only in the correct position. The bend of the legs must form a right angle. The movement is vertical, and the elbows go down due to the strength of the back. The torso should be lifted by the muscles, and not by swinging or pulling. The beginning of the pull-up complex is a breath, then a pause. The end is an exhalation. Don't lift your chin, and don't tip your head back in order to avoid neck spine injuries. Grips too firmly. If you have any strange sensations on pains, if it is not the usual fatigue or creature, you should stop training and make an appointment with the doctor. Thus, if you follow the basic rules and regularly train on the crossbar, you can extend your health for several years. Do you work out at the bar or do you prefer it to fitness clubs? Share with us in the comments. Friends, we recommend you watch our other video in which where we talk about the benefits of squats. Thank you for your likes, comments, and subscriptions. At the bottom of the video, you will find a lot more useful information. All the best to you.